Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So for this week's video I wanted to film another hair tutorial because I haven't filmed a hairstyle video in like eight months or something ridiculous. I thought it was about time I filmed another one. I decided to film this half up bun hair tutorial. I have done something like this in my back to school video um, like a while ago. Like since then I have completely and utterly changed the way that I do my half up buns and I think this way it looks a lot better. I thought that I would recreate it again and show you guys the way that I do it. I wear this hairstyle to work quite a lot and it's really really quick and easy to do. My hair is a day old hair so hair style is good if you haven't washed your hair in a few days and you want to make it look like your hair is not greasy just chuck it up and a half up. I'll let you know my hair type is fine. I do have lots of it. Hair style will work on straight hair, wavy hair or curly hair. A lot of volume in here and a lot of volume in here. If you have straight or wavy hair and you want to curl it, this hairstyle does also look really, really nice with curly hair. If you want to see how I created this hairstyle, then just keep watching. So what you want to start off by doing is just giving your hair a brush through. side parting like me you just want to comb it all back you want to take a section that is sort of towards the edges of your forehead so one back this way and one back this way and you want to make sure that the lines are straight and then you just want to give it a comb through and just make sure there are no tangles in it and then you just want to secure this with a clear elastic just because it makes it so much easier. And then because my clear elastics are old and I'm like reusing them, I'm just gonna put a second one in. You want to add in a little bit of back combing just to give it some texture. What I like to do is just to split that in half. So maybe a third of the way and just push down once. Do that about three or four times. And then just do the exact same one. Just want to spin your hair around it. There's no like specific way to do this. And then you just want to take some bobby pins and just bobby pin it in place. So it does not move throughout the day. You can also pull at the bun a little bit if it's not quite the shape that you want it to be. And then you get a bun that kind of looks like this. We place it on your head is up to you. So you can place it further back, like at the crown area if you want. You can place it further in the front. So then to get some volume in this bit, you just want to take the end of a sectioning comb and just stick it in there and pull it a little bit. And that just gives it a little bit of volume. Get some volume at these side bits. You just want to take a section and then you want to put in some back combing. So going from about here and pushing. You can see it creates like a little bit of volume. And you can always just smooth it out if you feel like it's looking like a little bit rough. Then what you can do is if you feel like it does look a little bit oily, you can add some dry shampoo in just like in through here. If your hair doesn't really like to like the volume created in it easy or if you find it hard to like back comb or even if you find it hard to sort of like twist it around into a bun, you can use some dry shampoo to texture it up. This one is the Batiste Instant Hair Refresh Dry Shampoo in Pretty and Delicate Rose Gold. I really, really like the Batiste. Uh, shampoo range. They're really really affordable and yeah they're just really really nice. And that is how you get this half up bun. So really really easy and I feel like it just looks really really good. dress this up you can get a little power bun topper and put that on like that would look quite cool for spring or summer if you could get some clip in colored extensions if you wanted to wear this to a festival also some glitter hairspray would look quite cool again if you're going to a festival if you do feel like you need to secure it even more than the bobby pins you can use a hairspray. But if you guys did enjoy this tutorial, then please give it a massive thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. If you are new to my channel, then I just want to say hey and welcome to my channel. 
and hope you decide to stick around and join our family here on this channel. If you do have any tutorials that you would like me to try and create or if you find any pictures on Pinterest or Instagram, send me a DM and I will try and film it for you guys. I do have quite a lot of hairstyles and like tutorials and things on my channels. So I will link the ones that I have done previously down below. Check out some of my social media links, they'll be listed in the description box below. Like my Instagram, my Facebook, my Pinterest and my Spotify and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! We are very overexposed. One moment. So you guys can see. Oh my gosh. That's Aslan. He wants to come in my room. You want to say hi? Come here. You're hardly ever in my videos. It's always Motsi. Look, Azzy. Look. Nope. He wants to go. He's too intrigued by my hair ties down in front.